Since the pandemic, people have complained about downtown smelling like a toilet because of public urination. Well, now the city is addressing the problem. Krista Rose has details on the temporary and permanent solutions to the problem. Pittsburgh alleyways have a variety of sights, sounds and smells, some of which are better than others. But now there's a new movement afoot here in the city to clean up alleyways, and that's by installing more public restrooms. In a new study by Point Park University, experts examined how to address waste pileups in downtown alleyways. This is to help improve the quality of life for people visiting, working, and living in the area. 72% of people surveyed in the study believe that alleys in downtown are an issue, citing trash pileups along with public urination and defecation that cause a terrible odor. It's no wonder the study also says the big issue? Well, the city doesn't have enough public restrooms. Now here's an example of the problem the city of Pittsburgh faces. If you're here in Market Square, the closest public restroom is over a half mile away in Point State Park. Not exactly close if you have to answer the call of nature. We spoke with several vendors setting up booths for Thursday's farmer's market in Market Square, and they agree there are no close public restrooms to where they are, and it affects them like everyone else. As a vendor, I have the same issues as everybody else. You know, I, I have to have a break once in a while, and if I'm here and I need to take a break, then uh, I have to impose on one of the, one of the businesses in, in the square. So what's the solution to cleaning up the city's alleyways? Researchers recommend the installation of lights and cameras, dumpsters with locks, and of course, more public restrooms. And the city seems to be taking these recommendations to heart because starting in September, a six month pilot project will be initiated by the installation of three trailer-like public restrooms. These amenities will be open daily, have running water, heat, and air conditioning, along with a cleaning staff. And while it's not known where these restrooms will officially be placed in the downtown, the thought is that they will go in high traffic areas like Market Square. And the hope is that this will be a stopgap solution until more permanent facilities can be built. Everyone we talked to seemed to be for the idea. I think more public restrooms accessible to everybody um, would be a, a great thing. Now again, the sites for these temporary restrooms have not officially been chosen yet, but it's safe to say that as soon as they are, the city hopes it will relieve at least one of their problems. Reporting in downtown Pittsburgh, Chris DeRose, KDKA-TV News.